Hello and welcome to our free online course for AutoCAD Electrical. So for the first lesson for this uh, free online course is the interface of AutoCAD Electrical. So this is, I have already opened the AutoCAD Electrical uh, software. Okay, over here we have, um, the interface is quite similar with the normal AutoCAD, but there is a um, few uh, others uh, like tools and also it's the project manager is already by default is open for us. So for AutoCAD Electrical, um, managing by project manager is quite important. So let's say we we'll go through over here first. Let's say we want to open anything. As you can see, it's now it's enable any sort of tools or command that we can open. So let's say we want to open any project that we have over here. This is the pre default uh, project or template that have been created and built in while we install the AutoCAD Electrical. So let's say um, we want to grab any of the project to try. Okay, you can just go over here, right click and activate. Okay, so activate and then wait a bit. Okay, updating. And then later on, it will become like highlighted in white in color. Okay, as you can see. So this is our, uh, now is a active project. So to enable all the other button over here, we can either create a new drawing or we can simply open a drawing from within the project that we have. So for example, this one, this one is a from IEC demo. So let's say I open a schematic subfolder. So which is this one, I will show you how to do it later on. Okay, and then let's say I open some drawing. And then as you can see over here right now, all the tools and command have already been enabled. Lah. So we have to open any sort of drawing. So within or not within the project lah, also can. So this is the uh, for IAC demo, schematic drawing. Okay, so for now, I don't want to use this yet, but I want to add a drawing. So let's say, like I said just now, so we uh, want to add a new one, just create a new, okay? Create, just simply create, later on we can just kill it, not a problem. Then let's say I open a new project over here, and then maybe I want to name it as a, okay. Uh, F O C. Okay, and then this is the location that we want. We want to put our file, so I'm happy with this. Okay, and then this is the template we want to copy from. So let's say we have um we want to create a new project, but we already have the template that previously, um uh, from our company or any sort of pre default template that we can copy of it. So for now, I will just go with the default one. Okay, we just go OK. And then as you can see, there is a new project file created just now. So over here, there is um, nothing over there that actually only have the file folder. So to add something, maybe a drawing. So let's say over here, I have some drawing that I want to put. So I will just click add drawing. So I will locate the drawing first. Lah. So let's say for this one, I go over here. And then I want to copy all of this drawing and put it inside the project folder that we have created. So control A, copy. So I go back to yep, this folder that we have created. I'll paste it over here. And then for now, okay, I want this one, this all of this drawing to be inside of our project. So I will click that. Okay, then yes. Uh, okay, just simply click yes. Now we have to be, okay. So right now, all of our drawing has been added to the project file that we have created. So to open the drawing, just simply double click, okay. And then over here, what we can do is actually to move between the drawing, we can select each of the drawing lah. but what it will do is it will open a new file like over here one two so let's say you click one until 10 it will have a 10 file open for you lah. so let's say you don't want that okay we can move by using this next project drawing 
So what it will do when we click over here, it will move to the next drawing within the same project. So let's say I click over here. Okay, it will move to the next drawing. It will open the next drawing and the previous one it will um save and then it will close the project. Okay. So uh, make sure you doesn't uh, mistake the undo button with the arrow button over here. Okay, so that's to move between uh, within the project. So I want to right now to show you how to create a subfolder. So it's just simply go to the uh, project folder. Okay, and then add subfolder. So let's say I want uh, this name as uh, schematic. And then let's say I want to put this uh, schematic subfolder at the top. I will just go over here and then I will just drag to the top. Okay, so all of this uh, project has become inside of schematic. Okay, to make it uh, inside of the schematic subfolder, just click and go to the schematic folder, just draw. Then all this drawing will go inside the subfolder over here. All right. That's it for to create the subfolder. So this is the other uh, tab that we have when we download the AutoCAD tracker, which is doesn't have at the normal AutoCAD lah. So such as uh, the home is uh, like the same. Okay, the project is the new one. Okay, with uh, some command schematic tab. Okay, which have insert component and then the panel tab report and the others. So. So I think that's all for our uh, free online course for lesson one. So see you around for another lesson for this free online course of AutoCAD Electrical. Thank you and see you again. Bye-bye.